I should pack up muscle at a young age. I don't have a lot of muscle in my body, I get that, and I'm not really a guy who has a really great physique, but I want to share with you my experiences that I believe can help you grow more muscle if you like me as a young age. Currently I'm 16 years old, just turned 16 years old 5 days ago, so I'm really young, I'm trying to help young people to be better and uh, be more mindful about their life, because I see a lot of young men basically just drifting in life, partying, drinking, alcohol, and just don't they are just don't aware of the fact that they are living life and i don't want to see grow up men regret that they wasted their young years personally i believe i have a lot of testosterone naturally i have more than average people because <laughs> I already have beard that I just shaved. I have beard since I was 13. I have black hair too, and really, I have a really strong black hair since I was 12. So, so I believe I believe I have a lot of testosterone naturally, and um, and yeah, this is kind of a blast basically because uh, you know as I'm getting older, I'm maturing, I'm I'm stronger, and basically my muscles are growing so much faster too uh, as I'm maturing. So yeah, this is I believe this is a really big advantage for me personally. But in my personal experience. When I experienced the most growth in my muscles, when I started to eat more protein, I, I'm not really a science guy, I don't really want to cover what protein is, but when I started to eat more protein, no matter what it is, if it's in meat or protein powder, when I just increased the protein amount that I'm eating every single day, I'm eating around uh, 80 to 100 grams of protein. It's a little bit less that I should eat because you know the protein amount that you should be eating is uh, one gram of protein per pound by the way i'm eating a little bit less than that but uh, in my experience it's enough for me maybe later i will increase it when i'm cutting and the person you're booking right now so when you're booking it's not necessary to eat so much protein so right now 100 grams of protein 100 to 120 grams of protein it's enough for me so when you're booking it's enough to be under the protein take but when you're cutting it's really important to increase it and uh, maybe be one gram per pound by the way, so it's more important to stay on that range when you are cutting. When I was 12, 14, I was in the average level. I, I wasn't fat, I wasn't skinny, I was in the in between, I had a little bit belly, but uh, I was really in the sweet spot where I could start to put on muscle mass and then. Uh, I didn't have to really, I didn't really have to work on burning fat. I just started off with lifting heavy. So yeah, young age, I was really lucky, I believe, because I was really in the split spot. Also, when it comes to splits and workout, I started off with a push-pull leg split. I believe this depends on what you enjoy the most. I started off with a push-pull leg split. I didn't enjoy it that much because personally, this is only just my personal experiences. Don't count it that it's bad or something. I believe for a lot of people, it's perfectly fine and it's perfectly great and they enjoy it so don't count it as i'm saying as a bad thing I it's just my personal experience is that i didn't really enjoy it that much because uh, i got weaker got weaker all the time i didn't perform really well maybe i did too much exercises too much machines that's why i got weaker and weaker day by day and uh, i i i couldn't really perform well maybe that was one of one of my really big problems but I felt like I was the strongest at the time. Almost, I benched more in the beginning of my workout journey. Benched almost more than right now. I'm starting to get back into the competition of myself, but uh, at that time, I benched more, almost more than right now. I believe mean, it's a little bit funny that with push pull exploit experience that I was stronger than right now. But with right now, uh, with with this split that I'm doing, it's uh, I'm doing too many parts one day. Have a little bit less machines. I'm doing uh, two machines for one body parts and uh, simple exercises. It's a simple split. I don't know if you are interested in that. I could share with you uh, my split. But basically, with this split, I'm covering every body part twice a week. So with this split, I feel like I'm happier. I don't feel like I'm tired as much and i feel like i'm 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 looking better i'm looking so much better uh, so so i don't know this is all just my personal experiences that uh, I, I saw a lot of growth when i started to eat more protein and i started to see more growth too when i started a different split this is all just my personal experiences my split is basically basically it's just an arnold split with a little bit fit tweaks on it so i'm focusing on getting 8 to 12 reps but i don't really focus on getting 
12 reps, I more like focusing on my muscles and I, that way my pump is so much better. I feel my pump so much more as I would focus on the reps. So you should you should start to focus on my muscle connection more because you will get a much better pump and you you will experience that your muscles are growing faster. I don't know if this is true, but for me, for me personally, I experienced this that with my muscle connection, your muscles will grow faster and I felt felt my exercises more. So yeah, yeah, this I just wanted to share this video for young men out there. Maybe uh, this can help you when you start your workout journey. This can help you with uh, what you should do research on. I don't take any pre-workouts. I don't take any more supplements, only vitamins. I take omega-3 and calcium and magnesium. Those are the only things I I'm taking. Protein powder, this, this, these are the only three, nothing else. And uh, for me, this is where I feel the most half in my body. So only my personal experiences don't take that I'm, I'm uh, judging anything in this video. This is, I just wanted to share this because these are my personal experiences when it comes to lifting and working out. Thank you so much for watching this video and if you enjoyed let me know in the comments what kind of split you are doing, what kind of workout plan you are doing and, um, and yeah, see you in the next video. Bye!